Hey folks, welcome to another VR video. Recently, I got to go to the San Francisco Art Book Fair. And at that San Francisco Art Book Fair, I was introduced to a media reel by a group called Most Ancient. And they were going over their in-development VR project called Diatribes. Uh, but by finding them, uh, that application is still in development. They had a previous application called the Wee Bridge Mausoleum. Uh, and I wanted to check it out and show it off on the channel. Now, this is the first time I'm going to be checking this out. Uh, so I'm not really sure what to expect. I can just say that the artists that worked on Diatribes made this, and that was a very unique-looking application. I'm always into virtual worlds that might be otherworldly. So this was one that I thought would fit that description. Uh, hold the trigger to activate your reticle. The triangle follows your head movement. Use it to select play. So we've got, okay. Now I do want to say this is a fairly old application at this point. Point your reticle at the MM plate to load the mausoleum. You can use the MM plate to open or close the menu at any time. So again, there we go. We're now activating a kind of otherworldly mausoleum in front of us. We've got these canisters in front of us. Uh, if we aim with our gazed reticle here, it's my understanding that you can Make the container go up. Toward the ceiling. And as it gets closer to the ceiling, it starts to spin like this. And while it's spinning, ah, oh, this one's got horses. So this reminds me of old, uh, animated films in those like circular chambers that you could spin and you could see like a small animated film i don't remember what those were called this stuff definitely is reminiscent of that let's see if we can pull the uh, chamber down we should be able to uh, Attach it. There we go. Wow. So the horse has whinnied. Uh, we also have, it looks like a flashlight of some form. Okay, so this one looks like it's a kangaroo. Let's try that same action here. Now again, I do want to continue to mention this experience is free on Steam and it was made several years back so it's not the most high tech and advanced application on earth but I like what they've done they've made like 360 cycling animated features into an interactive VR experience and kind of a tribute to these animals uh, or the spirit of those animals or the essence of those animals. It's very cool. So we've got the kangaroos. It appears I have to wait a little while after the image has begun to uh, start to pull the Once you detach it from the ceiling, it comes down on its own. I didn't know that's what kangaroos even sounded like. Let's see. Let's go. Uh, what's, what's this one over here? Looks like a lion, maybe? Let's find out. Let's pull it out. 
Whoa! That one just split and exploded on its own. This one seems to be some form of monkey or gorilla. them. Oh, wow. These are awesome. So again, maybe not the most high-tech thing, but this is visually very cool. And it's got pseudo-spatial audio, like that was kind of trippy actually. Let's see what this one over here is. Now note, I didn't, uh, really check this one. I didn't shine the light on it first. Oh, it's an elephant. The other thing is you get kind of the scale of each of the animals. Like, these elephants are much larger than the monkeys just were. This is very cool. Elephant down. Wow. That's a uh, massive trumpet from the elephant there. I feel like this one's, yeah, it didn't even try. This one looks like a buffalo of some form here. Let's see. Yeah, see, if it doesn't, it's, it's just exploding when it doesn't, uh, the ones that are cracked are really cracked. I don't want to clean up the mausoleum, I want to see what happens as I open each of these. So we've got two more here, I'm going to assume this one's going to crack, because again, it's kind of damaged on top. It's just a camel though. I'm not sure why some of these are, quote, defective and others work fine. This one is going to spin. I think this one's stuck because of that reset button. There we go. Got it free of other stones around it. Let's see what this one is. This is such a cool effect. Oh my gosh, I saved the best for last. I love birds. That's exactly what this is. This is so cool. So now that we've done all of the animals, I'm wondering if something special will happen. The 
got the moon up there as well. Just looking inside these rocks is kind of cool too. Come on, pull down. stuck up there. We'll give it another moment, see if we can pull it down, because I want to see what happens when all of them are... There we go. So once it releases this last spirit, what happens? Anything interesting? That seems to be all that it does, unfortunately. But this has been a look at the Mui Bridge Mausoleum. A free experience. It's available on SteamVR. I'm playing it with Virtual Desktop just fine with the Quest 2. A couple little bugs, but again, this is a free experience. Not much you can complain about. And I really like the imagery of the animals that it projects across the top when you release each capsule and free the energy inside. Uh, Diatribes, the other application by Most Ancient, is a application that at least the demo portions that I saw deals with climate change in a very unique and interesting way. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll be back with more content soon. Until next time, get out there and enjoy some VR for yourself, and thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.